I spent nearly 270 hours at various locations around Fulton County um, watching every aspect of their election process. And at no time did I ever observe any conduct by Fulton County election officials that involved any dishonesty, fraud, or intentional malfeasance. There was systemic mismanagement. It was very, very poor, poorly managed. Um, the, the sloppy processes top to bottom, things that really need to tighten up if Fulton does want to actually have credible elections moving forward. However, none of these sloppy processes and poor management uh, would should be used to uh, challenge the or assert the argument that the secretary and the state election board should not certify the result. Uh, this is just poor processes, but Fulton managed to get everything. If you read the, my whole election week notes that are coming out, um, you will see that they managed to make their numbers zero out. They got it there. You know, they got it over the goal line. They made their numbers add up. Yes, the uh, the vehicle was held together by you know, duct tape and chewing gum, uh, but it got over the goal line. They count tomorrow. Don't put it in the mail. It's too late for that. Instead, drop it off in person. I also had complete access. I could go whatever, wherever I wanted, whenever I wanted. Uh, no one ever thwarted me from going into any back rooms or anything. I did not see, as has been accused, anybody printing ballots. I've heard of you know the pristine bubbles too perfect, whatever that means. Um, it's all you know. It, fiction can be fun. I think that Fulton could be doing more to address their mismanagement issues. And uh, um, you know, I haven't seen any change. And when you don't see change in the system, this you know, limping or broken or darn near it, um, it's very concerning for future elections. Okay.